being gardeners we often find problems here and there for example plants are about to die not growing well and many more here is one similar coleus plant which is almost about to die though coleus is very easy to grow sometimes bad things happen the health is really very bad so what to do in such case hey guys welcome to gardening a bit and i hope you are doing very well i am going to give you a very simple method but please make sure to watch till the end as i would provide some other tips as well at this stage we have two options option number one either apply fertilizers on the plant and hope it would come back again sadly this is not a good idea as many varieties of coleus plants usually die after flowering especially the hybrid varieties variety like this one is hardy and they don't die that easily or even these two but current variety is a hybrid one and this needs somewhat more care let's take a look at the option number two this is what we should do and it's easy to do instead of worrying too much about the plant let's take few cuttings before more damage is done six to eight inches long cuttings would be fine remove the top parts and flowering spikes if there is any as you can see i got many more cuttings next step is interesting for the potting soil mix i am actually going to use very poor soil while reporting any plants usually we loosen up the root ball and while doing that we always lose some soil so what to do with those soil we can use such soil to grow many plants and coleus is one of them they grow in any soil for example here you can see lots of soil which are simply lying on the floor not going to mix anything at all and going to use this soil as it is before filling the pot please make sure to keep some hard objects on the drainage holes so that water can drain out well like as usual my assistant is here to help me planting the cuttings is again super easy just insert around two inches inside the soil and then press the soil gently so hey guys today i'm going to plant some um this what is your name colias colias so let's do it we are done with two pots next it's time to water after that i would keep the pots in indirect sunlight in the meantime what to do with the mother plant well if you like you can ignore the mother plant or wait and hopefully it would come back again in my case it did not survive look like i took important steps at the perfect time anyway let's take a look at the result It's the result after 70 days and here you can see absolutely different result. Just take a look at the plants, growing quite well and color is also amazing. On this pot, almost all cuttings grew successfully. That's why the pot is looking very pretty. Unfortunately, on the second pot, only one cutting survived. Not a big deal. After some days, this pot is also going to look much fuller. Here are three important notes. First, though the color of coleus flowers is attractive, it's always a good idea to pinch the top part as soon as it starts to flower. Something like this. This is a good way to keep them in good health for many days. On second, let's fertilize both plants so that they grow even better way. For that, taking NPK 191919 in 1 liter water. Applying directly in the soil. Applied around 70% on the first pot and rest 30% on the second pot. We can apply the same once in 25 to 30 days and as of now, I haven't applied any fertilizers. In case you want to use only organic you can use this seaweed extract 
or anything else you prefer. It's available on Amazon and those would be 5 ml in 1 liter water. Please try to apply in the similar interval. On third, so far I am keeping these plants only in indirect sunlight. Though many varieties of coleus plants can tolerate 2 to 3 hours of direct sunlight, direct sunlight burn the leaves of this variety. Honestly saying, many varieties need at least 2 to 3 hours of direct sunlight for the bright foliage. If you love coleus plants, I am sure that you would love to grow many other attractive plants with colorful foliage. In case you are interested in knowing more, please do check out my next video. I hope you found this video useful and if you did, I would really appreciate if you give it a like, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel if you are new to gardening a bit. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Have a great time and enjoy.